Hi, my name is Sam Olayemi. I'm the lead instructor and the founder of Code Learners and Soya, School of Applied Intelligence and Robotics. Now, I'm the lead instructor here, and I'm also the chief future officer that prepares the teams and guide the sequence of technology in the school of Africa. Now, basically, we started Soya in 2021. Presently now we've trained over 100 students. We are created from non-tech community into a problem solving capacity. And we have also a company called Codeners. Codeners started five years ago. And presently now we are partners with over 17 private schools and we're training over 5,000 online students from school students in Nigeria and within the US precisely. So basically COVID so is actually a the tech company and ed tech company that school of it's called School of Action Intelligence and Robotics that focus in developing the problem solvers for Africa. And we've been doing this for the past one year and we've been doing extremely very good in this sense. From teaching web development, both full stack and back end, robotics, subject intelligence and robotics, we have Python to provide them with UI and videos, 3D model and designs, Eptica, King and the likes. So we started this and presently now we are the first set of people in Africa that develop our own modern world ourselves, so, meaning that we are building our own Arduino board from scratch, designed and manufactured by an assembly our students basically. We train every single Nigeria from the age of six years to 60 years, meaning that we've trained this couple of times, we've trained 60 years old in other person, we've trained 50 years old in man. Presently now we are training a fantastic set of people which we don't really have a favorite, we don't have age restriction, neither do we have career restriction, in as much as you know that technology is something we use on every day, every day uh, on our daily lives. We all need to understand how this works. So, who do we train? We train every single person. We need to solve problems in Africa and also with the best big team coming out from Africa, Africa and other places. So, basically, now the last day of year that we, we trained was two months ago, and they are all online teaching right now. It's payment, meaning that these guys are people that have left universities and feel like, what can I do for the next in my life? And they are not an account, which is a student sort of funding. So the school, we don't really, okay, presently now we train, could let us train primary schools within, we train primary schools also, we also have a partnership with Nigerian Air Force Primary School, which we train them coding and robotics for little children from the age of 5 to 10 years old in all Nigerian Air Force Primary School in Nigeria. So, who are those that can take part of that? Because it doesn't really matter where you are coming from. In as much as you are open to learning, you have this self-discipline and resilience, trust me, you can learn coding. It doesn't really matter which knowledge are you, educational background. If you've done it before, remember, I've seen people come around and feel like, hey, do you have to be very good in mathematics before you can do coding? Trust me, it's a lie. Coding has been extremely so simplified that anybody should be able to learn it and build a solution out of it. So basically, so we offer different kind of things. So our own operation, 
our own dynamics of operating is a problem solving capacity. You don't just come and come and learn coding. By the end of three months for each category of students, we build it to be a product solution. So for instance, now the particular students that are going through our particular courses now, they are all young people willing to solve practical problems. So we have a project that we are trying to turn to to revel, to destroy this the restaurant business in Nigeria, whereby the operation of a restaurant will be automatically done by robots. From your menu to your chef to your delivery guy, everything will be automated. And I think the products that's a approach for learning. You must have a program before you can even earn a certificate. You must develop a solution and not just for educational sake, but solution that can be used by society and can solve problems for the soul of Africa and also make the world a better place. Thank you very much. My name is Samuel.